Oh, yeah. Boom. Yeah. Do you want to be a space pirate, Jason? I do, actually. Where do I, where do I train to be a space pirate? A hooded, uh, grapple hook swinging. Cape. Oh my god, that's like, yeah, that's Boot exactly wearing. what I want to do. Gloved. I've, shit, I've got gloves. Chrono belt. I've got a chrono belt okay. at home. I could do this. I mean, you could be a space pirate right now, then. Really? Okay. Well, I mean, what does that entail? Like, it really. Uh, so you're going to hang out in your space lighthouse. Awesome. Okay. Uh, you're going to swing around on your space grappling hook. Yeah. You're going to feed ghost gems to your goo compass. <laughs> hmm. This game has a really cool intro. It's a really long oh, intro. This is uh, Flint Hook. Yeah, let's just play it. Yeah, it's awesome. It's a cool game. It I'm looks really, really, really good. I'm really into it. It's tribute games. Yep. They made Wizorb. I like Wizorb an awful lot. Uh, they made Mercenary Kings. I kind of like Mercenary yeah. Kings. Yeah. This seems like easily their best game to date from they, what I've played. They've got a way with sprites that, uh, yeah, that draws me in for fantastic, sure. Fantastic, uh, fantastic pixel art in this game. Uh, but it plays really well. That's okay. the, the main thing. It's basically a roguelike. So we're gonna go on a run, I guess. I have not beaten the first boss yet, which is kind of embarrassing. So you, uh, it's a pirate uh, game and it's a roguelike. Yes, because last time I checked the trophies, most of the people who had access to the game had already beaten the first boss. Oh, gotcha. I have not. Bad which is Billy Bullseye, is that our, that our target? Yeah, so this is gonna be the beginning of a run, basically. I think subsequent bosses will unlock here as I after I take out this first guy. Uh -huh. uh, but so basically, once you pick your boss, that's a run. Just so you know, okay. How this game is structured. Ooh, I got a booster pack to open. Ooh, what? Wait, I already have one of those. You get booster packs? Oh, I got two booster packs. Okay. Okay, that's not so bad. I'll take that. Is that just for this run? Uh, well, so those are perks. Okay. So uh, you basically have a perk budget up there. Oh, so these like are, a loadout. Yes. Yeah, okay. so these are these are one slot. Uh, that one's three. These are two. Um. I'm gonna go... These are one-use cards? No, 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 these are just equipable. Cool. So you equip these once at the beginning of the run, and then you can't change them until you, until you die and start a new run. Okay. So... Uh, do I want to move fast? That's a freaking DuckTales move that I haven't even tried out yet. But that's three slots, I don't know. We should try that. Okay. Okay. I like bouncing off of stuff, right. too. So I'll, I'll equip that. The only thing I'm missing out of the uh, uh, pirate garb is the white hood. Hmm. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, maybe better to leave that one alone. Oh, okay. That's just my opinion. Uh, how about... Uh, let's get some more health. Okay. All right. And we're good. Some survivability. Yes. So you equip your perks, and then... Uh, so the top right, I need three gems. Okay. Three of those ghost gems to uh, tackle that boss. Uh-huh. And basically each ship that I beat, each each one of these pirate ships that I go tackle will give me one gem. Those look space worthy. Yeah, so these have, you know, kind of roguelike-y descriptions at the bottom, kind of some some indication of what you're gonna find on that particular ship. Oh, gotcha. Uh, relic shop sounds cool, except I haven't figured out what relics do yet. Should we find out? Yeah, I've bought a couple and they, they didn't seem to do anything. But. Huh. Uh, there, there is there is a little amount of, of that type of roguelike stuff of, you know, like, uh, you're going to pick up an item or make a choice and you don't know exactly what the effect is going to be. Oh, gotcha. Because the descriptions are kind of vague on stuff. Gravity uh, is your foe, but the chrono belt is your friend. Yeah, it's pretty good for slowing down time. Okay. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, I, I love that anchor. This game is about this. This is the whole point of this game, and it feels amazing. Like, oh, shit, you it's, seem pretty good at this. I, I've played this game for, like, two hours. Like, it's... it. You just pick it up. That looks to be like 360 degree control for the yeah, yeah. grappling so, hook, so right? I can, I can Oh, aim. and shooting. Yep. Whoop. Oh, oh now rad. time. Yep. Okay. Oh. Nice. Oh man, I bounced on that guy, that's cool. Did it do damage? I couldn't uh, tell. I didn't, it seemed like no, not sure. Uh, the coins disappear pretty fast if you don't pick them up, so... Try to get those as fast as you can. What's in here? We cleared it. Much stuff. stuff. Health. How Health. often can you do the uh, the time warp thing? Not to be obsessive, but I missed this, and I have oh, to geez. need every coin I can get. Man. Yes. Uh, it's pretty fast. Uh, so it, it runs down like that. Yep. And then and then it refills and charges, then it goes away. Right back up. Okay. If you don't see that little meter, you should be able to do it. Yes. Okay. Or even if it's like partially. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. 
Oops. Not what I wanted to do. Ah! Okay, so it looks like a map of sorts in the upper right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, these these individual ships uh, or levels, I guess, are, are pretty short. You could finish one in like ten. Whoa! Oh. Fifteen minutes. Ah! You did it. Yay. More stuff. Okay. What else have you found in those those chests? Uh, those are mostly just health and money. Okay. Um, you find lots of other stuff, but not in... Well, sometimes you get sub-weapons out of those. Mm -hmm. uh, where do we want to go here? I'm a fan of always going left. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I will check out Stick left. to the left wall. A second. Oh, You'll boy. make it out of any maze. Eventually. Maybe. That's good. That's, that's hot roguelike advice. Huh? Shit. Oh, we got a pretty good soundtrack, Rocky. Yeah, too. yeah. Game's got good music for sure. Gimme. What is that? I don't know. Oh. Whoa. Yeah, like I, I still don't know what those green gems. Ah! Whoa! Oof. Damn it! I'm trying to. So it's hard. It's it's easier to. It's hard to explain. It's easier to get a feel for when you're the one playing. Oh, I'm sure. But like. How close you are to a hook sort of determines how much momentum you get off of it. Okay. So, like, so the closer you are, the yeah, less. Yeah. So, so basically, like you could you could like grab one from far away and then like catch it again to get like a, a good fling off of it. Huh. Like it, it's it's a lot easier to understand when you play it yourself than okay. to have somebody explain it. But the bottom line is the feel is is really good in this. That's super you just, important. You just zip around. It's it's a ton of fun to play. I feel like I've, I've seen this on shows for a couple years now. Yeah, it sounds like people have been checking this out at, at PAX and stuff. I had I definitely heard the name, I just didn't know a whole lot about it. Mm -hmm. oh, ah. oh, oh crap, it's not good. Ah. Oh, nice. Oh, that's not so good. Wait, oh, you have to get that up there. Oh, yeah, we'll, we'll come back for it. Probably. Sweet. Ding dong. What are those for? Uh, they are kind of like switches. They'll oh, okay. activate certain things. Oh boy. So these guys, you have to pull their shields off. Get to bubble bobble them. Yeah. Oh. Busted bros. Oh, nope. I mean to do that. Once in a while, you'll grab onto something you don't mean to. But oh, sure. It's oh boy. Man, I but for the most part, it seems kind of sticky. Yeah, I have to be I'm like really super it up here. This is embarrassing. Oh, geez. I've never seen it spawn in guns like that before. Yeah. yeah, that was sad. I should be doing better than this. Bomb pickup. Yeah, so that's a sub-weapon. Kind of like a... Sort of like having a, you know, your secondary weapon in Castlevania, except that uh, you can only use it once. Oh, really? Uh, I should okay. see what this does. Okay. Alright, cool. I mean, I need a lot more than that, but True. that's a good start. Uh, so these cards that you buy in the levels are, are only active during your this run. Okay. So those, those go away at the end. Ooh. When I die. Enough. Okay. My health. Yes. That does look really fun. Yeah, it's it's just really feels really natural. Um, uh, this is one of the slightly more annoying things about the game. This is the end of a level. Um, <clears throat> and if so, if I hit this treasure chest, it just forces you to exit the level. Okay. Uh, normally, I would go back and check out those other rooms just to make sure I'm getting everything I can, but just for the sake of time, let's just move on. Okay. Uh, but you know, since it's a roguelike, you're trying to get as much gold as you can and stuff, like you kind of have to do some backtracking to crush it. Make sure you get everything. Eat it. You're welcome, buddy. 
Thank Anchor, yep. Okay, yep. good. Yep, it's really it's good stuff. Oh, what is the lore? I don't know. They keep talking about it. I'm not sure if they're just joking or not. I haven't seen a lore section yet. Um, I don't know for a fact, but I think the skulls at the bottom are just supposed to indicate the difficulty. Difficulty? That's, that's my assumption. Yeah, same here. The higher skulls definitely seem harder. Skulls uh, are typically no good, so yeah. the more of them... Let's go for the video games. Treasurium slash loot. Yeah, that sounds fun. Is that a wooden ship? Yes. I, I, I like the... That seems space-worthy. I, I like the wooden pirate ships sailing through space motif. Pretty cool. I'm sure it explains it in the lore. Yes. Oh. Screw your bubble. Screw your shield. There. Uh, Some... We've, we've kind of... I, I mean, the levels are randomized, obviously. Uh, as per roguelike tradition. But, uh, we've, we seem to be hitting a lot of just kind of generic enemy rooms, but, right. uh, they, there's a decent amount of variety in the, like, sort of combat challenges. Uh... In the combat challenges? Yeah, or? like, these, these little rooms that you walk into that kind of lock you in until you, until you finish them. Gotcha. Like, because that, that's the majority of the combat in this game. Um... And I've definitely seen more variety so far than we've seen here. Well, that's good, yeah. All right, you got a bomb. What are you gonna do with it? Ah, uh, yeah, I keep forgetting to use those. It's tough because it's like you get one. Yeah, right? it, it is single use, so I do sort of tend to hold off on to on, on using it more than I ought to. All right, what's going on in here? Oh, oh more of these guys. All right, just hit on bubbles. Oh, oh, slow it down. Yeah. Later. Oh. Oh no! Have you found any like a uh, you know, hidden passageways? Like uh, you know? nothing like that so far. It's okay. Pretty straightforward in terms of exploring the map. Like it just kind of shows you all the rooms. Okay. Unless they're you know unless it's hidden so well, I've just totally bypassed it. So you left that bomb back there. Can you go back and get it if you uh, if use I use? It? Yeah, I'll use one here and then I'll go yes. back and pick that one up. Uh, oh. Oh. Uh, well. Oh. That was not used very effectively. <laughs> it looked cool. That's all that matters. Yep. Yeah, you end up doing some cool ass looking moves in this without even actually needing to sometimes. <laughs> like just, you know, zipping around, swinging around, like slowing down time. To yeah, you slowed down time, like bopped that bird in the head yeah. and continued to shoot it. Yeah, that stuff is really fun. Uh. And like, like it just, it, this game seems like it has a really high skill ceiling on it, so like people that are way better than me are gonna end up doing some really awesome stuff with it. And it's got like, it's got daily and, whoa, it's got daily and weekly challenges, so, and leaderboards. Uh, so, As them roguelikes should. Yeah, so I, I could see people getting like really into uh, the like kind of competitive aspect of this. Okay. Have you seen uh, leaderboards uh, populate or anything? Or? Uh, yeah, there's been there's some people on it. Okay. It, it just, it, the game just came out today as a sure. recording. Oh, nice. By the way, there's a ball jump. So I see. Nice. Ah, couldn't do it. Whoa. Uh, hmm. Okay. Let's see. Get it! Oh, uh, no. Should just stay on the ground. The, it's hard to explain, but the... The stand in place and aim and the uh, slow down time are on the same finger. So like, it's hard to do all those things at the same time. Whoa. Huh. Okay. These guys are green. I want to say these guys drop bombs. Okay. Yeah. Whoa, oh, yeah, I there's see. One. Ah, there's another one. Nice. Why do I keep... Oh, I gotta stop doing that. Okay. Stuff! Oh, that's mm. the end of the level. 
So yeah, like, like I said, you you do end up doing a little bit of backtracking here and there to go get the stuff you missed. Let's see. Jump. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, you can do it. Yeah. Oof, there it is. Ah. Whoa. Ah. That's not good. It's a good, a pretty good, uh, like grappling hook mechanic. Yeah. I, I was expecting at first to be more swinging, but it's like yeah, that's kind of what I was to and was expecting, like maybe a little more bionic commando ish. Uh -huh. But it's kind of more like a slingshot. It's cool. Yeah, yeah, it's it's really good. Uh, see, doesn't that look like you can, you can go through there? But I hate to do all this backtracking, but I'm super curious what's in that last room. What do we miss? Oh, yeah, just the one room. Okay. There's a, a lot of it is not obvious. They don't tell you a lot of it up front, but there's a, a lot of nuance to the controls. Like, I just sort of fall like that. Mm -hmm. But if you hold down, you fall a lot faster. Oh, really? So you can actually control even how fast you fall. Like, there, there's just a lot of little tweaks to the, the movement you can do. Oh, yeah, that's right. I was supposed to get yep. that bomb. Whoa! Oh. Man, I'm just shitting it up left and right here. Nope. Uh oh. Once in a whoa. Once in a while, you'll kind of grab a door without meaning to. Nice. I like that you can just shoot, whoa, the, shoot the treasure chests open instead of actually opening them. I was hoping we'd find a little bit more of the roguelike-y stuff in here. I mean, you'll find that you'll run into, like, random vendors that have, like, uh, kind of one-off, like, bespoke upgrades and stuff uh -huh. like that. Uh, just haven't seen in a lot of that stuff on this run. Uh, what do some of the, uh, the upgrades entail? Like, your weapon? Uh, it's- a lot of it is, like, health-based stuff. Okay. And XP boosts and, and stuff like that. Although, some of it, like, I- uh, Oh! Some of it- God, man, I'm <laughs> really crapping it up. Uh, like I said, some of it I don't actually know exactly the meaning of because they they give you those those you know those good vague descriptions. Oh sure, of things. Ooh, yeah, that's not what I was looking for. Okay, uh, going left. Man, those look like treasure chests. Not like that guy though. Big fat chest. Yeah. It's a happy treasure chest. We show. Jump. And jump. All right, that's two. We need three. Yep. Right? Last okay. one. Let's see if we can do this. I made it to I made it to the boss ship once on this first run, uh, and is it always the same first boss? As far as you know, promptly ate shit. Yeah, it's always that Billy. Okay, what's his name? Uh, I don't want to go there. No. Loot. Loot. Oh, but it's got a three. Hmm. Well, three is the lowest. So they, they all get harder as you go. So okay, three is three is the best I'm gonna do. I see. Uh, let's go for loot, I guess. Yeah. Some boote. Frost Globe. Oh, I haven't seen that yet. I think you might have to buy that from the black market before it starts showing up. And I'm assuming that like once you buy something from from the black market, whoa, uh, it'll keep appearing. Yeah, like, the the stuff you buy in the black market outside of a run uh -huh. uh, is permanent. Whoa, the stuff you buy from the little in level shops like this guy. Hey, finally. Oh my. It's a happy Sultan. Yeah. Dude. Sell stuff. Uh, okay, so that's just health <laughs> as combo speed. luck. Let's see, I bet that's more time bells. Probably. Yes. Oh, so they, they really Great. don't tell you until. Okay. Uh, these they do tell you. There are other, there's a different class of item that, that doesn't tell you. Well, the relics don't tell you what they do. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Uh, I got a ton of money. I should probably get that. Critical blast. Last chances match the number of your combo. Okay. All right. I don't need that health, really. 
but it's space meat. Yeah, eh, maybe I'll come back for it. Ooh, good lord. Whoa, what's up with this guy? Oh, jeez. <laughs> nice. That's cool. Oh, boy. Uh. Mm hmm. Oh, boy. Uh, not what I oh. wanted. Whew. Oh, yeah, that, was, that was really slick. Yeah, yeah. I, I, it was, like I said, I was not totally trying to do that. Like, stuff seems to just sort of happen in this. Or like, it, it, ah. uh, it's kind of brain, it's kind of game where your brain just sort of like reacts faster than you can consciously think about what you're doing. Mm -hmm. In some cases, because the controls are that fast. Like, it's, it's whoa, jeez. All right. We might need that space meat after all. Space me time. Ooh, I got a key. Whoa. Good, I've never seen these guys before, I don't think. That's cool. Shit. Bad time. Oh. Oh. Oh god. I'll let this run end right here. Still okay. Nice. Nice. <laughs> yeah, some good sound work at least. <laughs> ah. For as much as it's leaning on, you know, like the, the 16 bit, you know, like aesthetic appeal, it's, it's, it's modernized, right? Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Oh, you probably couldn't get this level of sound out of. Uh, oh, definitely. Not, yeah. yeah. Or just this much animation. Whoa. Mm -hmm. Cool. All right. Hmm. Ah. Thread that needle. I'm really glad that it's not like a, you know, one and two and done kind of hit situation. Oh, yeah. Yeah, managing health is kind of a, a, a big part of a successful run. Yeah. I mean, there's perks that you can get that'll like get you a little bit of health back at the beginning of each new ship or stuff like that. I'm totally going to go buy that space meat. Yep. It looked delicious. I would love to beat this boss. Oh, we're gonna. Let's hope. Yep. Actually, Whoa. slow Curious. it down. I'm I want you to, to slow if, it uh, down and like kill three birds in one jump. Uh oh. No, we're fine. Let's see. Oh, there's that key door. Yep. Oh, what's up? What's this? What's this business? Tonic. Man, that's most of my money and I don't know what that does. It's not health, because there's there's a red potion that looks like that that gives you health back. I, I assume this is something else, but... So that's purple juice, like purple source Rex. Yeah, I think he tells me Which is the best Kool-Aid. I don't know if they make that anymore. Pur purple? Purple source Rex. That's yeah. the best flavor. Yeah. Uh, I don't... I don't think I can... Uh, you know what, let's find out. Yep. Oh, that's, is it just a full health? Maybe a charge? Maybe, maybe the potion, it's a maybe, badass potion. Yeah, maybe maybe the potion is like partial health. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Ooh. Oh boy! Yeah, get rid of that dude. Oh, this. Mmm. How fun. Ooh. Dong mofo. Fantastically executed. Bro. Hey, thank you. Okay. I bet this is the end of the level. Yep. Yep. Ah. Sorry. Well, we don't need that meat. That's true. What if there were like some good perks or something that's, in one of those rooms? That's true, yeah. 
What do we got for a secondary? Just a bomb? Yeah, I really want to maximize your run. Oh, I never used my key, actually. We gotta go see what's in oh, my key. Oh, totally, yeah. That was key. Okay. Uh, okay. What's that guy up there, though? I don't uh, trust he, him. He'll, he's like a... Uh, I don't trust him. Like a thwomp kind of guy. Like, oh. he'll, he'll drop when I... Also, how do I actually... Can you slow down and key through? Oh, I see. Oh, okay. I didn't think I could make that jump. I don't know what those green and red gems are. Nope. All right. All good. Hmm. I guess I could just move on. Yeah. Probably just move on. How good could that room be? Whoa! I got full health. Special. Right. Get my stuff. Feed my compass. Spooky gem. Hungry slime. Saying what I see. All right. Okay. Yeah. So, like I said, you just uh, beat the required number of levels, and then they let you go fight the boss. Okay. They Should let I... you go fight the boss. Yes. Like, could you go through some? No, other they, I think first? they. I think they warp you straight there. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't look like I can do anything but go here. Fight this dude. Okay. So let's fight this dude. Curious to see if this is exactly the same as it was last time. Or if they randomized some of this boss stuff. Uh, let's Space see. meat. Yeah, so there's a... Random space meat that I don't need. I like that giant tentacle. Mm hmm. Okay, yeah. This is this is the same as it was last time. Okay. Like same room layout? Yeah. <clears throat> I came super that makes close. Sense. That's him, right? Isn't that Billy? The little green guy? I think so. Okay. I got like right. Oh, there's a meat. Oh, wait. I, I didn't want that. It oh. wanted you. Ah! That well, was going well. Ooh, what's that chapter? Okay, yeah. Oh, oh, that was also bad. Throw that bomb. I have to do better than this. You got a bomb on tap, just so you know. Dude, this is sad. What's wrong with me? Wish I'd been able to avoid that meat. Yeah. You wouldn't think this guy's all that bad. You got like the multiple things to watch out for. Yeah, but the the, and the, the kind of bullet hellish aspect of, of this boss fight gets way worse toward the end. Uh, where's that starfish? Yeah, just remember you can you know, slow down time. Yeah, you need to panic. I really need to use that more. Ah, yeah, you gotta take some time and clear these guys out once in a while. Okay. Ah, Ooh. shit. Yeah, see, once in a while, like I was trying to grab his tail and I... nabbed the other thing instead. Ah. I'm not liking my chances here. I like him. Oh, there's that space meat in the oh, other nice. room, just chilling. Right. <laughs> Should I go eat it? Nice. Made so many unforced errors here, I'm starting to worry about when it actually gets hard. Oh, shit. Dude! <laughs> oh. Uh, you get a bunch of good little perks, like one of the, one of the perks I got on one run was, uh, like, you get a few... Uh, like a couple seconds of invincibility after taking a hit, stuff like that. Oh wow! To, just to avoid situations like that. Yep. So there's a bunch of little combat modifiers that kind of make the runs feel pretty pretty different. Ah. And 
Mm -hmm. That looked like it should have hit. But there we go. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's just when he starts spraying bullets like this is when it starts getting tough. Mm -hmm. Nope. Oh, oh, it's going for his tail. Oh, shit. Those guys suck. Oh. Sometimes you get in a bad situation where slowing down time is just not going to help. Right. Like the angle is bad and you just couldn't get out of it if you wanted to. But it might give you the opportunity to like uh, grab a hook behind you or something. Yeah, kind that's of, true. Kind of retreat. Yeah. Oh, so close. If I'm super careful. Yeah. Kind of stay away from, oh shit. Stay away from him as much as I can. The bullets aren't as much of a problem. Yeah. That worked out. Oof. Mm. Oh, I got greedy. Ooh. Can you throw that bomb in any direction? Or? Uh, yeah, it just kind of throws it in an arc. Yeah. Okay. I'll give it a shot. Well, I mean, okay. do what you know. Whoa. -ho -ho -ho. Fuck! Five health. I don't know that it's all right. Still living. Still space pirating. Oh boy! Oh, oh my God! Oh, yeah! yeah! Holy crap! <laughs> awesome. Oh, crime oh. river. Bullseye Rex is now available in the black market. Okay. Just for the peace of mind. Yeah. Going back for my damn, <laughs> meat. damn space meat. Wait. What? Oh, they just, <laughs> they just taunt you with it? I thought there was like a way to get it if you didn't have full health. Right. That's, that's really rude. Jerks. Oh man, okay. All right, I'm glad I got that done. I would have been really sad if I had failed at that. Like Billy over there. Whoa, what's that guy? Okay? Oh, I'm back here with whoever that is. Okay. Hmm. Dude. Yep. Cash money. Oh. It's a pretty big chest. Oh, that is a big chest. Get all my other stuff first. Yep. Oops. Oh my. Wow, what is all this? I don't even know. The booster pack. Oh. Bounty. Okay. Oh, is this my next boss? I think it is. Oh, okay. Sure. Wow, that's a lot of gold. Imagine all the space meat you could buy. Oh, that's that's a lot of hunks of meat. So I'm curious. What is that? The combo meter down there. Too. I didn't really quite. Yeah, I, I I barely even have time to keep up with my combos. So I'm curious if that is like the end of a run and then you can start from that second boss whenever you want. So you, they, they only tally your XP up at the end of, uh, well, when you die or I guess when you beat a boss. Sure. Uh, and then every level you get a uh, good card pack. Yay. Okay. Hell yeah. All right. Some new black market stuff. There's all the stuff I got on the run. Uh, cool. New stuff to buy. Leaderboards. All that fun stuff. Okay. Uh, so that get, all means new stuff. Did I get new uh, relics? What's new here? Got that for hitting level 10. Okay. Got that for beating the boss. Got some others in here somewhere. Yeah, I got the telephone. 
Yeah, I have no idea what these do. Wow, If yeah. anything, they, they may just be kind of collectibles. Uh, okay, what's the name of the black one? I don't know, they made a pretty big deal about it when you when you got it. Yeah. Uh, so those green things, those green little skull slate things down uh -huh. there, uh, those are, that's kind of your permanent currency to unlock oh, sure. stuff here. Um, spinning skull, skull, skull sub weapon, there's that frost globe. Yep. I really just want progression stuff right now. Like, I think the most valuable thing you can get is more perk slots. Okay. Uh, let's see, that's more XP. Oh, that, depending on how well you do. That's... Oh, okay, so that's what, that's one thing that relics do. That's cool. Um, worry about that. Let's see, that just gets you more XP. Also more XP. Uh, you can expand your health. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's tempting. Uh, oh, wow, so you can... Ooh, okay. geez. All right. Ooh, what was, what was that sniper ability? Gold bonuses. Oh, uh, that's just the thing that lets you stand in place while you're aiming. Gotcha. Uh, all right, so that's everything. I'm, I'm just going to go for... Let's see. So that would be six. Is there anything for four I can... Ooh. Okay, yeah, so I could get perk slots. Yeah. That sounds like just a flat XP modifier. So what is that? Versus that one's per relic and mm. that one is how well you do. I'm just gonna get this. Okay. Sounds good. All right, let's, let's just pop in and see what the next... Yeah, I wanna see how much it is. Okay, uh, cool, so you can environment start... Change. Yeah, so you can start from the second boss. Okay. I guess you could do another run on this guy, if you wanted, just to grind out more kind of XP and, yeah, probably. and money and stuff. Yes. Okay. Cool. All right. Cards. Cool. Huh. All right. Wow. That's, That's cool. Good. Um. Man, look at all those perks. Yeah. Let's see. Let's slap a few of these on, so... Make sure you get that 25 health. Yeah. Take me 135. That's plus 5. That's plus 10. Let's slap one of those on. One per uh, actually, how much is the move speed? That's two. Let's do the move speed totally. and one XP modifier. All right, I'm just gonna pop in to see if the, the levels on this boss look any different. Yeah. Or if they've got any different stuff going on. Uh, Haunted Chamber. Yeah. Haunted Chamber sounds interesting. Tornado of Hurt. Yeah, I wanted to see that. That would be pretty useful. All right, new look, new music. New music, yeah. Yep, yeah, that's cool. Uh, this game's pretty great. Da, 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 da. How much are we talking though? This uh, is, I believe it's 15. That's, yeah, that seems like a bargain. Uh, yeah, it seems like you get a good amount of time out of it, especially with the you know, weekly challenges and stuff like that. Yeah, any idea on how many bosses there are? Uh, I think it's five. Okay. Ooh, what's this stuff? Oh, hello. Moody Prospector. No, I don't have any gold, so it doesn't matter. Huh. I wonder what that's about. Stuff. What platforms are we talking? Uh, uh, definitely PS4 and PC, and I believe also Xbox One. Okay. Uh, let me just double check on the bosses. I'm curious. Pretty sure it's five. It looked like five. Yeah, so I think you can quit out at any time to kind of cash out the whatever you picked up. Uh... Yeah, and one, then, two, three, four, yeah. Looks okay. like five bosses, and then you've got the hardcore versions and stuff. Yeah, not bad. Uh, and, challenges. And then whatever this is, which uh, maybe lore? Probably. Or I, I like I like the idea that they keep talking about a lore section that doesn't actually exist. Yeah. That would also be pretty <laughs> funny. Um, yeah. Oh, seems, that's your daily stuff. Okay. Yeah. Seems like a lot of good stuff packed in here, uh, and it plays super well. I, I really like this game. Sweet, yeah. Uh, and it's out now. All right. Well, thank you, Brad.